Hi. In this video I will show you how to create a basic list of data from a database table. For this we will use a connectivity application form. Let's start by creating a new form. For our data list we will choose the connectivity app form. A connectivity form has a different way to set up compared to regular forms, basically, the form views and actions are defined in a global repository area, we can then call any of the defined views or actions in any of the app pages using a special code syntax. Since we need to display a list of items, we are going to use the table list view, let's add one from the views list. The table list requires a data source, that should be a data action, let's switch to the actions editor and add a read data action. Let's select the database table to read the data from, we will also change the default model name to something more relevant, then we will make sure that we read all the table records. Since we are going to call the actions and views in our pages content, we better give them more relevant names and titles. Let's switch back to the views editor and select the table list data source. We want to display two columns in our table, one for the article's ID and another for the article's title. Please note how the data path references the model name then the database table field name in order to be able to extract the data from the data source. Let's give our table list view a more relevant name and title. Now that we have created the actions and views needed, we should call them in our page using special Chroniforms shortcodes. We should first call the read articles action to load the articles list, then we call the table list view. Now let's save our form and test. Here is the resulting basic list of records.